All right guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. Now today's video, we're gonna be talking about what you do once you've come up with a name for your business, okay? We're talking about a clothing business. This is my clothing brand, Major Key Physiques. I talked about in the previous video how I came up with the name, how I came up with the logo, but what I actually missed was the website that I used to find the designer to make this logo up. And that was Fiverr.com, F-I-V-E-R-R.com. Now I've been using Fiverr.com for years now. Um, I started using them when I needed a YouTube intro done up. My first YouTube intro, I was like, fuck, what do I do? How do I do this? How do I actually make an animation? And the fact is, is that you don't do it yourself. You get someone to do it for you. And it's cheap. So go on Fiverr.com, have a scroll through. People basically list themselves. It's basically like freelance work. You will see them, they might have reviews, they've got you know previous work examples. You choose them to do your work. Um, you'll pay, it might be $5, $10, $20, $50, depending on what you need done. Anything, you can get anything done. You can get your tech packs designed um, for, the, for the clothing, you can get a website designed, you can get animations done, you can get logos done, like literally anything. Um, you've just got to pick the right person. You know, if you've got ideas in your head, if you've got like a, you can either even take a picture of a, of a, a drawing that you've done, you've sketched, and send it through. Like literally, be confident that these guys know what they're doing, they've done it plenty of times in the past, and if you give them enough information, they will produce something Stella. And if they don't, you've always got the opportunity to take your money back and say no, nah, and give them a bad review and that's it. So it's all in your hands as the purchaser, but um, you've got to give them a bit of trust at first because you have to pay up front and then wait for them to, to return the, the, the work. So I had this designed. It wasn't easy. I went through stages. It wasn't looking like this at first. In fact, this was inside something else. I decided to take everything else around it off and just have a a classic, you know, clean logo. MKP, major key physiques. That's it. The quicker you're here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is So today I'm gonna to continue with what I talked about last time. I talked about setting up a business setting up a, a website majorkeyphysiques.com and having a, some sort of landing page. Before you've got any products, before you've designed anything, you need somewhere to direct people to your website and get their, get their contact information. You need email addresses. Because at the end of the day, before social media, it was email marketing that worked. And it still works. You know, if you can get someone to go to your website, literally sign up because they really want to know about that business and what it's about, then that email address is gold. It's fucking gold. So over time, as you decide, as you, you know, start designing products, as you start building your Instagram page, possibly YouTube, Facebook, all that stuff, you will start directing traffic to that website and start building it. That is gold. That is going to be your little nest egg of people that are really interested in your brand when you've got anything to tell them, any product launches, anything like that, you can send them a bulk email and update them on what's going on. They're going to appreciate it. It's going to be great for you. So that's the first step. With that being said, how are you going to get the traffic to your website? We're going to be talking about social media today. I feel as though every business, you know, and this is going to be on, you know, what the name is. Okay, this is this is important. When you choose a name and a logo, you're going to go on Instagram, you're going to, go on, going to go on Facebook, you're going to go on YouTube, you're going to type in that name. You're going to see what comes up. If your business name is already taken on like all of the platforms, Twitter included, then it's like, well, fuck. Okay, we not, I, am I gonna be able to, you know, put a, a little hyphen in there and still make it easily findable? You know, if you've got major key physiques, let's say I needed to put major dot key physiques or major key physiques underscore, you know, it just wouldn't be right. And I wouldn't be happy. So the first thing I did when I thought of major key physiques, I went to Instagram, I went to Instagram, set up major key physiques okay i claimed it it's mine i got the instagram page went to facebook associated a facebook business page with that instagram account called major key physiques that is those two platforms not only are you going to be able to post product pictures on there start to build uh your your brand and start to build the hype around it but it's going to allow you to receive messages instagram dm facebook messenger i receive messages about the brand all the time Okay, so you need those channels. 
You need those channels for people to be able to contact you. That's it. On your Instagram business page, you're gonna be able to link an email address. If they really wanna contact you, they will click that email and they'll send you an email directly. So you've got your website, gaining email addresses through your landing page. You've got Instagram, obviously product pictures. Um, we're gonna talk about paid advertising in a, in a future video, I've done that. I've had varying results. Um, there's certain countries that you'll get shitloads of likes but no engagement. There's certain countries that you'll get no likes but every like that you do get, you sort of get some engagement. But at the moment, you've got no products, no designs. You might have a logo, a few pictures maybe, behind the scenes that you can start posting. You've got your Instagram page, start posting on there, receiving messages. Facebook page, start posting on there, receiving messages. In fact, Instagram is linked with Facebook. So when you post something on Instagram, you can actually go share uh, and click your Facebook and it's automatically shared. So once you post something on Instagram, boom, it's on Facebook too. And I'm assuming you can probably share it to your Twitter as well. So you've got Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Those three, Snapchat, is dying. I don't. I don't fuck with Snapchat. You can only. You know. You've only got so many hours in the day. So so much. You know. Time. And I feel like too many social media platforms is is going to be negative towards your efforts that you're putting in. So, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and a website. That's it. As far as the content that you start putting up, well, that's going to be up to you. But I will talk about that in a future video. Today's video was all about starting to build your social media, starting to build the hype, and that's what you're gonna to have to do. It's gonna be about the name, it's gonna be about having that name over the multiple platforms without any discrepancies, okay? So maybe you will have to change the name of your business. Maybe you will, because social media is fucking important. Go and listen to Gary V and tell me it's not. All right, so that's it for today's video. In the next one, we're gonna talk about actually starting to design the products as far as clothing. My business, Major Key Physiques, is a clothing brand. Uh, it's a clothing brand I've been building for the last year. This series is about me bringing my experience, what I've learnt, my mistakes I've made as far as getting it from nothing to where we are today, which is still not, not a lot, but can you imagine if in another year we were really big and I started these video series and people looked back and said, fuck, he actually did that. So I want to inspire people, that's what this is about. If you want to support me and this channel, please hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.